hey, 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 what's going on? How are you guys doing? How are you guys doing? How are you guys doing? It's Parker Talks. <coughs> Excuse me. It is Parker Talks. Listen, before we get into today's video, I want to tell y'all something. We have shirts available at any size, any color, blue, black, white, gray, red. I think that's probably the color that I'm always missing in, in, in all my videos that I talk about. And on the on on the uh, on the shirts, it's the it's a scripture. It comes out of Exodus 14, 14. The Lord fight for you. All you have to do is be be silent, be still. The Lord will fight for you, ladies and gentlemen. All you gotta do is be still, be silent. You know, because a lot of times we wanna we want to talk back. We want to give we want to give a defense. For why we act the way we act, why we do what we do, or whatever somebody gets up, whatever somebody says that that person does this, 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 we want to give an account for why, for 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 the accusations that's been a, that's been brought to the court. You don't have to. Truth will reveal itself. Truth will reveal itself, ladies and gentlemen. I tell you, the shirts are beautiful. The shirts are really good. Um. Uh, it's good quality. It's good everything. Oh, we haven't had pink for the ladies. Hey, for the ladies, we got pink too, and they uh nice V cut and everything. I tell you, the shirts look official. The shirts look nice. I partner with uh, my my friends ministry back in New York. Uh, we collaborated together on this. It has a lion's face on it, and it has a scripture on the bottom. Think about partnering with me. Thinking about coming together and picking up a shirt. It will help me out and it will help you out, you know, because you're going to be looking fly. You're going to be looking fly. Come on now. <laughs> All right, y'all. Tune into the video. Take care, y'all. Yo, what's going on? It's Perkins. So, how you guys doing today? Motivation Saturday. Y'all ready for this? Y'all ready? So, the last couple of times we've been talking about dating. And, of course, I was telling y'all how I really wanted the whole dating thing to go differently and it hasn't gone differently so I decided to be real with y'all you know so last week we talked about how there really isn't a manual to dating which there really isn't a manual to dating there really isn't a how to for dating right it is just built on experience it's built on your personal experience and the only way to have experience is to date sometimes you could not get out the parking and just Hit it up with one person and boom, boom, boom. There you go. You know, God bless. And then there's other times that you could not hit it out the park. And it's not a boom, boom situation. It's more like a boom. 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 You know? Like, like really, like, really, let's be real. That's really what it is. You understand what I'm saying? But, 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 today... We're going to talk about, we're going to go back into the intro to dating. So a lot of what I'm going to say today is going to sound like what I was talking about last week. And I apologize for that. But we're going to talk about it. We're going to talk about it because if there was an intro to dating, if there was a a, a how-to manual, then, then most of us guys will be able to know how to respond to different situations when different situations start to pop up, right? Like, for example, when a female says, oh, babe, do I look fat in this dress? And naturally, our response should be no, but most guys kind of respond with, well, you don't look fat, but it's a little tight around the midriff section. It's a little tight in the back section. Uh, I don't know. No. And then it puts us in a doghouse. Eventually, it puts us in a doghouse when we answer stuff like that. So naturally, if we if we had if you had a uh, 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 a how to when it comes to all of this, and naturally, if you had a how to on how to answer these type of questions, how to how to deal with stuff like that, then we will be able to we'll be will be easier just to respond to different situations like that, you know? And we'll be able just to, uh, just to come up or formulate an answer when someone asks a question like that, you know? Uh, and even just to have uh, something that's just, that's just, um, that will give you the knowledge 
in different situations is perfect, right? Because a lot of what people give you is their experience in dating, right? So they give you their experience, but in all reality, you got to take your own experience and go out in life and venture off in life and deal with it yourself or try to figure out how to deal with it. You know, there's a phrase, it's called, um, and it might be in the Bible. I don't know. I'm not going to quote that one, but it might be in the Bible where it says to eat the meat and spit out the bones, right? So naturally, whenever someone, and I don't know why I always keep saying naturally, it's just a natural thing, all right? But anyway, when someone, when someone takes, so when someone gives you advice on something, you're going to take in what they say, and you're going to either flip it or take their advice and use it, and it may not be the correct advice for you. So that's why I say you eat the meat, spit out the bones. Whatever is good, you're going to take in, ingest, and then whatever is not good, you spit it out like bones. You know, like you're not you're not going to eat the whole bone in in chicken. You're going to spit out the bones. You're not going to eat a, you're not going to eat a T-bone steak and eat the whole bone. Like unless you're a lion or something. Rawr, rawr. But in all reality, that's just what it is. So naturally, when someone tells you something. You're going to take it in. You're going to ingest it. You're going to, you're going to start to chew it. Chew up the information. Take it in. Receptive. Okay. Okay. Oh. That's how you respond. Oh, okay. 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 So that's what you do. Oh, okay. Got you. Got you. And then whatever is not good, you're going to spit it out. Right? And this whole idea of dating it's really a, a, a crazy thing. It's not something that is just so simple. It's not a, 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 a black and white issue. It's, it's really something that's not like that. It's, it's, it's because, because what you're doing is that you're dating someone, right? With the purpose of marriage. And of course, if you're a little bit younger, you're just dating, just a date. And whatever, right? Whatever. You whatever, right? But if you're dating to for the purpose of marriage, you're you're really getting into someone's life. You're really putting your putting your life in someone's hands and they're putting their life into your hands. And you have to really ask those 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 questions that that, that make you feel uncomfortable that that are just like, mm, I don't know if I should ask this, but I'm gonna ask it anyway. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put my hand on the fire. Hopefully, I don't get burned. You feel what I'm saying? That's really what it is. And when it comes to dating, it's like I said, it's not just a black and white thing where you're just like, all right, let me just work this and just see what happens. No, it's, 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 it's all, it's all, it's all a calculated risk. It's all, it's all, it's, it's all just getting in there. It's just. Figure it out, you know. Um, and a lot of times, what you really don't want to do is fall in love with somebody, and you have no intention on catching them. You feel what I'm saying? Because that's the worst thing. Playing with someone's heart and emotions. Ooh, that's the bad. That's the baddest thing you can ever do. It's play with someone's heart, play with someone's emotions. And just lead them in the wrong way. The wrong way. And listen, we, like I said, a lot of that deals with experience. A lot of that deals with making these mistakes. A lot of that deals with error. Because now, now, once you've done something bad, or once you've done it in a bad way, now you're able just to flip it and try to do it in the right way. Now you're able just to say, you know what? When I was in my last relationship, I did it this way or that way. So let me see if I could do it a little bit differently and come out with a different result. Come out with a different, um, a different method to the madness, you know? And that's really, that's really what, what has to happen. That's why I say dating is really just your experience. Dating is really just, just how you handle all of this. It's, it's, 
It's experience. That's what it is. And you're not going to be the the person that's going to get right every single time. You're not going to be the person that's going to hit the mark every single time. You're not. There's going to be times you're going to miss the mark. There's going to be times you're going to fail. There's going to be times that you're going to say something stupid. You're just like, I should have told her. No, it doesn't look. Ugh. No, she doesn't look fat in there. I should have told her that. Instead of saying, oh, well, your men drift out. You know, all of that comes with experience. It, 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 re it really does. But, but at the end of the day, like I said, when, when you're coming to relationships, when you're coming to getting, wanting to get deep down with somebody, um, and I'm, I'm, I'm not talking about that deep down. I'm not talking about that. But a lot of times when you want to get deep down with somebody, you really want to just figure them out, you know, see what they're about, see what, see, see how you, y'all two can get on the same page. And you're not going to always be on the same page exactly, which completely, excuse my language, completely sucks. But it's possible to get halfway on the same page with somebody. You dig what I'm saying? <laughs> for real, for real. Uh, yeah. Anyways, Perkins Talks, y'all already know how we do. Y'all already know how we roll. Uh, we just posting videos out here. That's just... That's just what we're doing. So, um, you know, whenever I do a video, it looks like I have just like a like a white spot right there. It looks so weird. Anyway, for those of you already know how we do, you already know how we roll to 2022. Year is almost over. So let's 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 get it. Let's get it started. This is like the last quarter. This is a, we in the fourth quarter, people. We in the, the bottom of the knife. So let's let's let us let us let us get it together. Let's put the puzzle pieces together, y'all. All right. Uh, I have sweatshirts available. I have all different kinds of colors. I'm going to post that at the end of this video. I said that last video, and I don't think I did it. But I'm going to post a sweatshirt, and I'm going to post all the colors that we got. So y'all could just hit me up and say, hey, you know, I would like a sweatshirt. I think they look kind of cute. I think they look kind of nice. We still got t-shirts available, too, you know, because out here in Texas, winter doesn't happen until late. Like, it gets cold in the morning time. So you're like, oh my God, where's my sweatshirt? So I got you on the sweatshirt part. But then when it gets to the midday, you're like, oh my God, I don't need this sweatshirt no more. It's hot. And now I got t-shirts for y'all. See how that works? You get a sweatshirt in the morning. And in the afternoon, you get a t-shirt. You wear a t-shirt in the morning, in the afternoon time. So anyway, so, yo, let me know. I got I got, I got y'all. I got y'all. Come on now. It's perfect, so I'll see y'all next time. All right, be blessed. Let's, let's do it. Let's go out and do it. More than conquerors. Let's go. Take care, y'all.